Hello! Today we are here to talk about action items in Google Docs. The action item update for Docs can really streamline the process of assigning tasks within your team, which is something that can be a huge time waster. However, today we'll look at how Google is using Natural Language Processing, or NLP, to make assigning tasks to team members easier than ever before. In Sheets, Docs, or Slides, you can manually assign an action item through a comment. So I'm going to insert a comment here and then mention the video's account. I'll have the option here to create an action item and assign it to that account, which will send them a notification that there is a specific task that needs taking care of. So for the next part, let's look at what happens once action items have been assigned to someone. We've assigned a couple to the video's account, so now I'm going to open up that account and show you what things look like from the other end. So here I'm in Google Docs for the video's account, and you can see that things look a little bit different than they used to. Now I can see this badge here, which lets me know that there is an action item assigned to this account which needs our attention. This is how you will know when action items have been assigned to you and that your supervisors or team members are relying on you to take care of a certain task. Hopefully you find this new feature helpful. I think it's a great way to more smoothly integrate the sharing and assigning of tasks from right within the various Google applications. And I think you're really going to enjoy using it. If you have any questions, just let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and have a great day.